Hello everybody, I'm Cell Sonic, and welcome to another Christmas holiday season event live stream. Hey, now this is the third and final holiday last. Oh, excuse me, it's the third and final Christmas holiday seasonal live stream out of the first two I did all this for this month of December. So yeah, I did one in October for Halloween events, but this one's for Christmas. Just before New Year's Eve, the 31st. So today is, it's as of, it's January 30th as of me streaming this stream, which will be eventually be uploaded as a video on YouTube, but breaking down the segments I do with all my streams. Who goes there? Hey, did you just come in? I just started. When did you come in? Just now? Hey there, right? Hey, I'm sorry if I didn't say that right. Hang on. God, I can't seem to pronounce your name right. Ray Ken, right? Ray Ken? Almost like Ryu. That's Ray Ken. <laughs> Ray Ken, hey there. How's it going? Nice to see you again. I just started the stream. Yeah, in my little intro or whatever. <laughs> I do that on YouTube, but I kind of just. I don't know, I just do it whenever, wherever, so like intro, outro, that's kind of where I just start like a video or something, but alright, let's begin. For this holiday season event stream, if you'd like to check out my Halloween, well, Halloween one, the one where I did for our Halloween events, as many Halloween events, throughout the month of October, and check out that on my YouTube channel if you're interested, if you want. But this one's for Christmas. Hey, Prof! Hi, how's it going? I guess it's my last Christmas holiday season event stream, and I'm trying to do as many hol holiday Christmas events as I can, because I like to go over and see all the different holiday events that there are. I'm about to start up this this game that I haven't played in a long while, but I wanted to check it out. I've played it before. How are you? I'm doing pretty good. Yeah. Great. Yeah, I'm trying to check out as many... I know, in the first one, I did Team Fortress 2, Smith Smiths, Dota 2 is Frost of Us. Oh, Frost Haven in Dota 2. Then there's Rocket. I thought that was just for the first stream. And then the second stream, it was like, yeah. In the second stream, it was Don't Starve Together's holiday seasonal event. It's like a winter feast. That's what's called Don't Starve Together's winter feast. That's their holiday event. Then there's. I think the last one, oh, it was Rocket League. I forgot what they're, I forgot what it was called. Frosty something. It was a holiday event for Rocket League. That one, that was their winter, winter holiday event in Rocket League. And then, last but not least, I did Fortnite's holiday event. Yeah, that's when I had Dev Gamer host, Dev Gamer apparently hosted me at that time. It's funny, <laughs> he hosted me. I was like, what the heck? Hey, it's Dev Gamer, ah, dang it. That's funny. Yeah, you know, that was the last one I did. That was the previous stream before this one, because I said I was going to recontinue the stream, and I recontinued this same stream three times already. This is the third and final one before New Year's Eve, and I'm probably going to stream a different game. Like, I don't know, I might do something like maybe more Fortnite again. Like, I guess some people wanted, me, wanted to see me do Fortnite again. I guess I could play it again. Maybe on New Year's Eve. I was thinking, I don't know, maybe Super Smash Bros. Ultimate again. Since I streamed that around the beginning of the month of December. But anyways, let's begin. Let's get started on this. The first game I want to do for this stream. I'm probably going to do uh, Sea of Thieves. That's the last one I'm going to do. Because I want to check out their whole holiday event in Sea of Thieves. The holiday event in Sea of Thieves. Yeah, New Year's Eve. Where I live. Huh. New Year's Eve where you live. Oh, it's New Year's Eve where you live. Nice. So you're probably a day ahead of me. That's cool. You're a day ahead of me already. So it's already the 31st for you. Well, it's still... Like, yeah, I want to get started. I don't want to drag this on too long. But I'll keep talking while I start up the game. This one, for this first holiday event in this last third and final of the holiday seasonal event streams before New Year's, it's a, apparently it's an MMO. It has a holiday event in it. I used to play this a while back. I don't play it a while, and I just wanted to look back at it, check it back. I know there's God Wars 2, but I haven't actually played it yet. God Wars 2, I don't know what their holiday event in there. This is called Blade and Soul. It's basically martial arts and mythology combined. Well, you know, like Black Desert Online, that's like, that's kind of fantasy 
it's not really mythology, it's more like fantasy, like with wizards and like knights, that kind of thing. That's what Black Desert Online is. So, Lady and Soul is like a mythology, but it's mythology based. You know, it's like folklore with, with martial arts in it. Yeah, I like that. So I like kind of wanted to check it out again for a little while. So now I'm about to start it up again. Let's see, we start this game back up again. Hopefully it's not going through like an update or anything. Um, yeah, it's updating. Please don't take a long time to update. If I had known this, I would have like done this sooner. You can't see what I'm seeing at the moment. Oh, do I have to enter that in? Oh crap. Hold on. Let's see, this is what I'm seeing right now. See, that's the game right there. You may have seen this game in the past, you may have heard of it in the past, but yeah, there's a little holiday of it, and I used to play this in the, uh, back then. I don't play it as much. I wanted to check it out again, as I noticed there's a holiday event in, it, event in it. I was gonna make a video over this holiday event in this game close to the beginning of this month of December, but I don't know, that never happened because I was busy with college. Oh, it's gonna enter in the password here. You, you can't see what I'm entering in. Let's. What, excuse me. Let's get that in. Alright. If I can remember what it is. Why would I forget my old password? I know what it is. Hold on. Yeah. I know what it is. There we go. And there. I know it's a pretty long password, but I remember it pretty well. Yep, that's it. Updates are available. You must be to download them to launch the game. You're kidding me. How long is this going to take? If I had known this, I would have done this like a while ago, before I started to stream. Ah! Like, I wanted to start streaming around 7 o'clock, but I don't know. I was too busy trying to just set everything up and going through some things like eating lunch and then dinner. That's what was going on. Oh well, guess I'll have to, guess I'll talk to you guys for a bit while we wait till I start this up. You're like, are you like in Australia where I can? Because it's like a day, they're a day ahead of us. In Australia, they're a day ahead of America. Where in America, they're basically like a day behind. So it's like Australia is one day ahead of, of in America compared to America. And it's like they're one day ahead of us. And they're eight hours ahead of us. Yeah, so you, if you live in the United States, you're like eight hours behind. You're like a day behind. So if it's New Year's Day over there and it's New Year's Eve here, there's New Year's Day over there. It's January 1st there. Well, it's New Year's December 31st here. That's the difference between like here in Australia or something. Yeah. Wow, we have to wait. I wish I'd known this before and would have been downloading this. A while ago. Oh well, that sucks. Yep, so we just have to wait until it finishes downloading. Darn! Yep, not yet. It's not New Year's Eve yet, but almost. Yeah, if you want to go check out all my other. They're all going to be uploaded as videos later on. The past uh, parts of this stream, the Christmas holiday events, where I try and go over as many. All the events and as many different games that developers have put into their games. Yeah, let's go check out what this holiday event is like or that one. Ooh, look at this one. What did they do for their holiday day event for this year? Something like that. Yeah, so I like to check out. That's kind of my iteration on YouTube channel. But close to the end of the month of every season, I start streaming. Close to the last few, the last like last week of that month, like in the last week of October, I start shooting, try and do as many holiday events as I can, many seasonal events as I can. That's what I do. You made me learn something. I did, huh? How about it? What did I make you learn? Look at that. it's still freaking. It's, this is ridiculous. Look at that. it's still downloading. God, I wish I had known it would take this long. If I had known it would take this long, I would have done this before I started streaming like an hour ago. Aw, oh, man. That sucks. Wait, what am I doing? Not that soon. That's the game soon. Yep, there we go. Things soon. What did, I, what did I make you learn? What did I make you learn? I don't know. You said I made you learn something. 
how their time difference between Australia and I guess anywhere else around. Well, then again, if you live in the United States of America or if you live in Australia, and here's another funny little thing. In Australia, it's actually summertime, while here it's winter. So they have Christmas in the winter. They have Christmas in the summertime. Yeah, Australia has Christmas. They have the holiday seasons in the summertime. Well, it's summer over there. Hey, it's, it's Christmas in the summertime. It's Australia. Eh, it's funny. Well, we have Christmas in the wintertime. There's snow. And they don't have snow over there. That's funny. Eh, well, you see, like, lights on your trees during the summer. Christmas lights. Well, it's festive during the summertime in Australia. That is funny. I like that. They actually reflected that in Overwatch with Junkrat and Overwatch. Because... He's got all this, like, summer stuff on during, it's like, or it's like around the winter season. And it's summer in Australia for Christmas. What the heck? It's funny. I like that. How many hours you are behind? Yeah, I'm like eight hours behind compared to Australia. So you're probably eight hours ahead of me if it's already, if you're already a day ahead of me and if it's already New Year's Eve for you, then... Within the next few hours, it'll be New Year's Day for you, while it'll suddenly be New Year's Eve for me. By the time it's New Year's Day for you, it's New Year's Eve for me. Yeah, I'm probably going to be playing something like Smash Brothers Ultimate again. Because I said I wanted to play the heck out of that game, Super Smash Brothers Ultimate. I said I was going to play the heck out of that ever since I did like a reaction video off of the Super Smash Brothers like Ultimate Direct. There's like a little direct, Nintendo direct, for Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. I was watching the final one, it's like, did a reaction video. I didn't do the reaction video off of the previous ones, but, I don't know, I just did a good video. I would have had. You see my reaction where they reveal King K. Rool, Smash Bros. like, oh, oh, I was like, oh, it's going bananas, you know, flipping, going off, bouncing off the wall. <laughs> and I was like, are you think Kenny? Oh, like, I like Donkey Kong Country. And they put, they put King K. Rool, Donkey Kong, his arch enemy, in Smash Bros. Like, all right, awesome. Because I love playing as Donkey Kong. You know, of course. I mean, what do you think when you see this? You know, you see Donkey Kong's face over life face, me doing a thumbs up. How does that not tell you that I like Donkey Kong? Seriously. <laughs> Seriously. Yeah, that's why I have that little, that's my avatar basically. Yeah, it's Donkey Kong. <laughs> and I do like to play as Donkey Kong and Smash Bros. What do you think of it? Like Super Mario or Sonic the Hedgehog? Oh, just because my name has the word, my screen name has has the word Sonic in it. it just has to be oh like it has to be a reference to a freaking blue hedgehog well it's not i can understand that this concerns me, but i can understand why some people would think that i get some people throwing memes at me and think oh my avatar looks like it has to do with expand dog expand dog what the freak oh i've seen that yeah no Kong, expand dog sorry but my, my avatar has nothing to do with has no relation to that meme. Or, uh, my screen has no relation to Sanic. Gotta go fast. Sanic. The meme. Dee -dee 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 -dee. When they use air horns, like. Dur -dur 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 -dur. The air horns of the Green Hill Stone song. What the heck? That is so weird. It's funny. Yeah, you remember that? DK is life for you. Yes, I love playing as Donkey Kong. I love the Donkey Kong Country series. Seriously, if if I were to go back and play all three Donkey Kong Country games again, I'd do that. Sure, I'd do like a playthrough or something like I'd be playing Donkey Kong Country again. All three of the trilogy on a YouTube channel or something, I'd do that. Because when you look at King K. Rool and Smash Bros, you see every, all of his moves are basically from when you fight against him as a boss in Donkey Kong Country, where he throws his crown in Donkey Kong Country 2, he wears a captain's hat. You know, he's like a pirate. He wears a pirate hat. And he shoots a gun that shoots cannonballs out of it. He does that as a move in Smash Bros. When that's really what he did. When you fight him in a boss battle. Like, in the last level. And yet, in Donkey Kong Country 3. He had this, like, jetpack propeller thing. And they actually used that for his up special in Smash Bros. 
So everything he does in Smash Bros. is everything he does when you go up against them in, in all three Donkey Kong Country games. Yeah, I like the reveal. There. Oh, it's like, <laughs> you have to see it. You know, they reveal King K. Rool. They show it. What the heck? What's King, King Dedede doing there? Because it's supposed to be like, you know, Sakurai, is the, the creator of Smash Bros., is the voice of, of King Dedede. And it's like, oh, it's like a troll. Or he's like, oh, no, it's King D. It's not King K. Rool. And he comes out right behind him and just snacks him behind the head. If you've seen that, you go check it out. It's funny. And the Donkey Kong's reaction and Diddy Kong's reaction, they're like, ah! Their eyes go bug out, bug eye out the window. Through the window, their eyes, they go bug eye through the, through the window. Like, ah! If you hadn't, if you hadn't seen it, go check it out. It's funny. Uh, it's on Smash Bros. website. I love that. It's like, oh no, there's something in there. Yeah, I can, yes, I had a headband on. Why am I wearing a headband? It's to keep the headphones on my head. I haven't mentioned that to you in the past, but yeah, look how, look at this. Why is it still taking so long? Oh my gosh. Is it going to be an hour until it finishes downloading? No. Wish I down, started downloading that like hours ago. Darn. Well, this sucks. This really sucks. I'm not kidding. How long am I going to be just sitting here waiting? You know? I was not expecting that. But yeah, I love Smash Bros. I love the Smash Bros. series. It's like, here's a little fun fact. Did you know that Smash Bros. is one of the, the first Last Man Standing type of games before the whole... Battle Royale subgenre sub -genre thing even came around and existed with Player Unknown Battlegrounds or Fortnite Battle Royale came around. Yeah, Super Smash Bros. is one of the first Last Man Standing types of games. Not to mention, there's also Mario Kart Balloon Battle. You ever played Mario Kart Balloon Battle? That's another Last Man Standing type of game mode. Yeah, Mario Kart, Mario Kart Balloon Battle and Super Smash Bros. series were the first last man standing because in Smash Bros. you got stock. When you play up to four people, you gotta be the last person standing with stock left while everyone else is taken out. That's the whole point of last man standing. Last man standing is just another term for, like, Battle Royale is just another term for last man standing. Of course. Those were the two, those are, t the, yeah, I mean, come on, this whole last man standing thing, more like five, 500 years. 500 years? What do you mean 500 years? Huh. What are you talking about? For the game that's downloading. Oh, yeah, it's like, what the heck? Yeah, it looks like, what is it going to take 500 years to finish downloading? It's an MMO by NCSoft. You know, they did like an MMO called, uh, called Wildstar. I used to play Wildstar. And, and in fact, I'm pretty sure Wildstar had a holiday event in it too. But... I'm probably not going to have time to get around to check that one out. Plus, that game's not going to be around much longer anymore. They wanted to finish off the, the last remaining of life that game has with a holiday event in it before they, they shut down the servers because the game is just, you know, for people who've played it for a long time, they're putting a holiday event one last time for it, you know, for it goes away. Kind of like, you know, Paragon from Epic Games. That's no longer around either. I used to play Paragon. That was a pretty fun MOBA. Paragon. It's gone now. Yeah, they had, the servers were shut down. They discontinued with that game being up. Yeah, for, that's basically for fans of the, the game and such. Wild Stars. So they did a all day that it just go out with a bang or something like that when it's no longer going to be around anymore. Because it's not really that. I don't know. You, you, you probably get where I'm getting at with what I'm saying. But yeah, that's how it is. That kind of sucks when games like that kind of just die out. But they kind of just finish it off. With, what's that word I'm looking for? With a... Uh, yeah, I don't know, I can't find the right words I'm looking for when I'm trying to exp ex explain, but you, I'm pretty sure you get the idea of what I'm saying, what they do that with some games. 
Yeah, this is so yeah, I'm just talking about random stuff here while this game is trying to finish downloading. Yeah, Smash Brothers Last Man Standing. Yeah, but see, people play Smash Brothers like it's a fighting game. If you played it with the mindset of it being like, think of it as a as a last man standing kind of game rather than rather than a fighting game. Well, it's a fighting game in the form of a last man standing kind of game because most fighting games like Street Fighters, Tekken, there's like a side scroller, you know, two D, three D kind of view where you have like a life bar. While in Smash Bros, you have like a damage percentage thing, and you're basically trying to knock people out of the ring. Well, you want to be the last person that's standing alive in the ring. See what I'm saying? Can you see how it's kind of like, it basically is like a battle royale, last man standing? Not to mention, there's an anime that did a huge reference off of Smash Bros. That's Dragon Ball Super. Like, what the heck? Did Dragon Ball Super just do a, do a huge reference off of Smash Bros? As you have a ring, and they basically have a whole battle royale with a bunch of fighters fighting in the this ring in, in that anime called Dragon Ball Super. They're all trying to knock each other out of the ring, but they're in teams of I forgot how many how many characters from. Wait, why do they have twelve universes all in the same timeline, all in the same universe? It's like, wait, what? Did they get the whole? How each universe has its own timeline thing mixed stuff compared to how Rick and Morty did it. Because in Rick and Morty, each alternate dimension has its own timeline. While in Dragon Ball Super, there are 12 dimensions all in the same timeline. I'm like, what? That kind of messes things up there. Weird how they did that with, I don't know, how they create that idea. What were they thinking when they did that? Kind of odd. But yeah, it's like... It's like the anime did a huge reference off the Smash Brothers. Because it's like, what the heck, the way to describe it, it looks like Smash Brothers. And, yeah, I don't say it's Smash Brothers is a battle royale because the creator of Smash Bros, Sakurai himself, calls it a battle royale. He calls it like a brawler. Oh, he says he calls it a four-player action battle royale game. Battle royale game, like, what the heck? Oh, so that's existed before Fortnite Battle Royale and the player on no battlegrounds existed. Even Mario Kart Balloon Battle. That one did too. It's like, hey, those games had Last Man Standing. So basically, Last Man Standing is nothing really new. You know? It's just suddenly made huge, like, as of now, when it's already been around for many years. We've already had, like, a Last Man Standing Battle Royale type of game mode for years. It's already existed. It's just now pretty big, because, you know, Smash Bros. is new. What the? I think all of Dev's followers should follow you and Dev. Uh, hmm, oh, that's nice. Yeah, yeah, no, maybe. Uh, it's up to people if they want to follow or not, but, all right, yeah. I'm not sure what to say about that, but okay. Yeah, I don't want to Dev's lots. I try to help De Dev in his, like, you know, Dev humor. He's a, he's a game developer. Right, he creates the he creates deal games for a living. That's actually something I've always kind of wanted to do. It's like kind of funny how I I actually came across with an actual game developer that I know who actually streams. I mean, seriously, how cool is that? You actually meet an actual game developer who creates deal games, and maybe not face to face in person, but you actually know someone who creates deal games, who creates CS:GO, or Little Combat 3 or Doom or... God, he did def I still have yet to play some of the games that he's developed. I said I was going to try and stream or play some of the games that he actually worked on and developed. I haven't really done it, played them yet. Like, I think there's Defense Grid or something that's a little tower defense game. Yeah. I'm, I'm going to college for like a game and degree or something so I can try... So I can try and like try and create video games myself. Because that's something I kind of always wanted to try and do. Like, I always like gaming. I guess I always had, like, a passion for things like animation and, and like, game design or game development. I'm trying to get, like, a gaming degree, and somehow it's like... I've been doing things with YouTube. 
because I hadn't streamed in a long time. Now it seems like I'm almost incorporating what I'm doing with video games into my YouTube channel, part of my iteration with seasonal events and stuff like that. So I'm doing. You're, you're friends with de with a dev like, with yourself. Oh, you're, you said with a de oh with a game developer yourself. That's cool. When you said dev, I wasn't sure if you were talking about dev gamer, but you're talking about because when people say dev, of course they mean they mean game developer. They mean because that's what dev stands for, developer. It's funny how we call is is you know his actual name is Steve Kramer. Uh, he, that's that's his that's his alias. It's Dev gamer, developer gamer, <laughs> with dev gamer, we call him de we call him developer. Like hey developer, well we say dev for short. Well, hey dev, you know, you're like what the heck? This is kind of funny when you think of that. It's like yeah, that's what we do. Kind of like you guys call me Al or or Sonic Al Sonic, because that's my that's my username online online name Elias. Besides my real name is just Alex Alexander. That's uh, well, I just go by Alex and Alexander, but yeah, hmm, that's not real new. I just, yeah, I know it's like Al or Alex, but Al, like Al Sonic. Yeah, I just like the way it sounded like who, so I just did that screen and I had that screen name since AOL and some Messenger existed. You know how back then people used to use AOL and some Messenger. It's, yeah, AOL Instant Messenger. That's when I first had that screen in. I was like, what did I come up with the screen in? And I just stuck with it because it seems like nobody uses that screen in. Seriously, you go online and you search for Al search for Al Sonic 24 or something like that, you'll pretty much only find me because I'm like the only person. When I look up there, all I see is stuff from me because no one actually uses the name Al Sonic unless you're talking about some like electronic technology stuff somehow uses the word Al Sonic for like electronic technology stuff. Other than that, there's no one out there with the username Al Sonic. I'm l literally the only person with the username out there as Al Sonic. I'm the only person who, who uses that name. So apparently it's that original. So that's why I consider just staying with it. Yeah. Unless I I copyright it so no one else can use the name Al Sonic. <laughs> I don't like trademark it because it's my name, no one else uses it. It's that original. I don't know, it's just a screen name. But I use the number 24 at the end of it. It's just a random number I use at the end of it. I feel like it just saying Al Sonic without the number 24. I feel like put the number 24 kind of makes it look better without a number. You know, just plainly saying Al Sonic without any numbers at the end kind of looks a little for some reason it just looks a little better when i add the number 24 at the end of al sonic it's just, it just looks better that way it's just plainly plainly just words without a number so that's why i added numbers in there and that's why it's a number 24 it's just a random number are you going to play the game yes i'm going to play the game it's it's downloading that's why i'm not playing the game yet see look at that it's downloading I'm not kidding. If I had known that the game would take this long to download, I would have did this before I started stream, like an hour ago or so. But since it's downloading, I can't like play the game yet. Like, oh dang it, I was gonna play this. I didn't expect it to take that long when, when downloading, because I had no idea. If I had known, I would have tried downloading it way before, like maybe two hours ago or an hour ago before I started stream. But, since I didn't know, yeah, we're pretty much just sitting here waiting. That's yeah, I'm just I'm just talking to you guys, just talking here while waiting for the news to start up. Cause I wasn't expecting this to happen. Like darn, uh, yeah, waiting. So I'm just sitting here waiting until it finishes downloading, and then I can start playing it. So yeah, pretty much. Like, god dang it, sucks that it's not done downloading. Because I wanted to play this. Hmm. If I had known, I would have just... Yeah. Downloaded before I started the stream. But since I didn't know... Yeah. That's what happens. You know, you never know. It's like, unexpected things happen. Sometimes you just have to 
improvise and do something different. Because sometimes, even if you plan for something, things won't exactly go as you want, as you planned it. That's why you gotta improvise sometimes. Things won't always go as you planned or wanted it to in life. So you kinda have to just... Uh, you have to do a little change of plans here and there every now and then. Adapt, uh, excuse me. Well, you have to adapt. Like, originally, I was going to do this stream, which I broke into three part streams. Like, I did the stream on, like, originally, this was supposed to be done on Christmas Day. You know, I was supposed to do this entire stream on Christmas Day. But then I did it in three separate days. I was trying to play as many holiday events as I could. Kind of like in the month of October. And I did the same thing, but it was for Halloween events. I played as many Halloween events during October, like Halloween night, which is October 31st. On October 31st, Halloween night, I played as many Halloween events. I thought I was going to play like a horror game as the last thing, but instead I just played Dead by Daylight. Dead by Daylight is the last Halloween event I did for that stream. So this is a Christmas, like holidays, holiday stream. For seasonal events, for Christmas events. So, yeah. Now I'm just like, because you know, in the first, it's broken down to three three streams instead of one whole big stream. That's what this is basically. What? Oh, is that bringing in the microphone to you? Profound. Why would you profound into I didn't know I was breathing into the microphone. I'm just talking. I'm seriously breathing into the microphone. Sorry about that. Uh, I don't know how you like... I don't know what, just don't be so close to the microphone. But sometimes the game can be so loud. Or if I'm whispering, I just talk really close to the microphone so you can hear me. You know, yeah. I'm talking really quiet. You can hear me real loud, right? Yeah, yeah. See? Of course. I was talking real quiet, but why would you burp out? You burp out into the microphone? Like, uh, yeah. Oh. It's like, chuck, 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 chuck. It's chuck a soda. Chuck, chuck. And it's like, it's close to the microphone. Yeah. yeah. Oh. 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 Like, what the heck, man? Why would you do that? That is weird. You know what I mean? Oh, God. <laughs> that just seems ridiculous. It's kind of funny. Oh, look, it's almost done. Seriously, I, w I wanted to play this the second I started the stream. I was honestly not expecting this to happen. This is not how I expect to start the stream. So, this is how I'm improvising. Just me talking to you guys for a long period of time, non stop, because I'm pretty good at talking la, 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 non stop about anything, whatever. You know, changing the talk. Is that how that's how I that's how I talk. I'm not kidding. Yeah, I can talk non stop about whatever while I wait for this to 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 finish downloading. I wonder how long I can do that. For an hour? Or more than an hour? Because it's me just saying what's at the top of my head most of the time. That's what I'm pretty much doing as I'm talking here about whatever. You're like no 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 ah, you're playing a funny guy yeah, like no 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 I guess some people can't really do that. Like some people can't really come up with something to say and just talk for a long time. I guess most people call it rambling or when you're just like unless you're doing commentary or something, like when you're doing something and you're like improvising, like you just what they call it your inner monologue. You talk about what's going on in your inner monologue. <laughs> Talking about whatever goes on in your head as you're doing what you're doing. Uh, that's called commentary when they're, someone's doing, like, I don't know, a playthrough or something in a, in a video on YouTube or something. Like, I guess it's some people do that. Like, what the heck? Hmm, I don't know, that's just an example. Yeah, I guess I'm pretty good at doing that because I, I am a bit of a chatterbox. I am very talkative. I can go on and on and on for hours talking here. But yeah. Sit back, enjoy me talking to you for hours and hours and hours and hours hours hours. Ah! Oh, I had it in small screen. Should have had it like this. Hours and hours 
Alice and Alice. Ah! It's kind of crazy with me talking. Yeah, most people don't want, most people say, dude, shut up, stop talking. Most people are like that with me. Oh, sorry. It's sort of, it's too one-sided. We're not actually having a conversation. Oh, yeah, I guess I'm pretty good with one-sided conversations. Well, that's not very good. What the heck, man? Well, I'm, I'm pretty good with having a conversation with myself. Is that probably what I'm doing if I'm not talking to you guys? Uh, <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> that is funny. We're almost done. Yep, it's almost done. It is literally almost done. Yes, thank you. Finally, you stupid freaking game. Why did I have to take this long to download? <laughs> Dude, it's already like 10.08 p.m. I thought I was going to be playing this like around 9.30 or so. Darn it. Oh well, it's all good. I probably can't play a certain... I'll probably have to not play the, play the games I was going to play. Not for very long. Like, I can probably tell you what games I'm going to play after this. Because last game I'm going to try and play is Sea of Thieves. Sea of Thieves, I like that game. I haven't played it in a really long time. Sea of Thieves. Because I know they have a holiday event in there. They actually had a, they had a Halloween event in Sea of Thieves. I didn't get around to it. Oh well. Oh, they had the Megalodon and the Kraken. That's cool. I actually did a stream with Dev Gamer on Sea of Thieves. I actually had that stream uploaded onto my YouTube channel. If you want, you can go back and watch that with me playing Sea of Thieves with Dev Gamer. And uh, there's Gobo McFly there and somebody else. I can't remember his name was. That's who was there. So it was like four people. Me, Dev Gamer, Gobo McFly, and somebody else. I can't remember their name. But it's almost done downloading. It's funny. It's like, oh, shoot, we ran into a Kraken. I'm like screaming my head out. Like, oh, my God, the Kraken, it's got me. Ah! 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 Help me. Stupid Kraken's got me. Ah! I can't get out. Help. Ah! And I got to see it. It's funny. Ah! But you're seeing it from my perspective. Because I'm like stuck in the Kraken's tentacle. And they're all trying to shoot it. They're trying to shoot at it while I'm stuck in the tentacle. Because it's like, oh, it like sucks you up and you get stuck in it. It's like, oh no, oh, shoot it, shoot it, shoot it. I can't move. Shoot it. They're all shooting it while I'm, while I'm basically screaming. I'm screaming here because it's, the Kraken's got me. Oh, I can't get out. I'm stuck. Oh, and like, <laughs> shooting the cannonballs. <laughs> Dev Gamer's like, ah, I'm gonna drink some grog. Ah. <laughs> like, they'll puking all, over, puking all over each other. Oh, they're drinking too much grog and seeing things. Just puking all over each other. Like, oh, oh, yeah, I'm a grog. Like, ah. Oh. Playing music while they're drunk in the game. Ah, oh, that game's funny. Seeing things. Can't wait to play that later tonight. Alright, so this game is almost done. Look at that, almost done. We'll do a countdown for when it's almost done. <laughs> oh boy. Woo. It's almost done. Yep, yeah. almost done. It's almost, 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 almost done. It's almost done. <laughs> it's almost done. It's almost done. It's almost, almost done. <laughs> okay, what am I doing? Excuse me. Hmm. Ah! Woohoo! There it is, look at that, almost done! 2.6 What the heck? Megabytes? Wait, how many megabytes does this thing take up? Where's it downloading into? Holy crap. Don't tell me it's going into... Uh oh. Shoot. Hold on, wait, what am I saying? Don't oh, excuse me, why am I doing that? Yeah, you're basically seeing all my freaking icons. This is Doom Builder, something I used in my level design class. My level design class. I create levels for level design in a level design class in college for my gaming degree. So I did. Yep, hold on, here it is. That's what I was looking for. Holy crap, I gotta do something about that hard drive. That's my backup, like external hard drive. Oh, snap, it's almost full. And it has only 89 left. And. Well, that's always been small, because it's only 111. 
that's why I start up this. Basically, what you see here is what I started out with. Because this computer I'm on right now was given to me by someone as a friend. A friend of mine gave me this computer. He kind of gave it to me as a, as a birthday gift, surprisingly, actually. Yeah. So, yeah, he basically he, he had some spare parts. You know, I guess it's like custom, I don't know, custom built. You know, just a bunch of parts. He built this computer. He put it, he got a bunch of different spare parts he had. It's a pretty decent computer. It's, it's what I start out with as I try to upgrade it over time. So, yeah, I didn't have this monitor I'm using, or I didn't have this camera that you see me on before. Like, I didn't have this microphone when I started. No, I didn't. I didn't have this stand that's on either. Nope, I didn't have any of that when I started. All I had was, I basically used the second display right here. Here, I'll show you. Let me show you what I'm talking about. Ooh, the game's almost done. Hey, it's done. Yay, compiling a list of new files. Oh, now it's verified. Oh, uh, that won't take long. Look at that, it's almost done. Hold on, let me see what I'm, I'm talking about here. Come on, yes, it's done. Is it? Is it? Done? Eh, I guess the wait was worth it. The wait has better be worth it. Yay, I can play now. But first, let me show you what I, I want to show you what I was talking about just now before we begin. Here, look, I'll show you my camera. See, look. See this right here? This is what I was using before as my primary monitor before I started using it as a secondary monitor to view the chat on. And I was viewing the chat on like a... Uh, oh, what was I viewing the chat on? I can't remember. Oh, no, I literally can't remember what I was viewing the chat on because I didn't have a second monitor at the time. I was probably using like, I don't know, my phone or something to view the chat. As you know, we all start somewhere when we start, like, streaming. Yeah, so this is what I was doing. It's basically a TV I was using as a computer monitor. And I'm using it as a second display monitor. While I use this, well, you can't see it because the camera sits on top of it. It's basically like an LG monitor, HD monitor. And over here, see that? What is that? That's a TV. Flat screen TV that's mounted on the wall. See the mount? Yep, it's rounded. Let me see if I move it. Look at that. Oh, move it. See the TV or so oh, something going on. Yeah, I don't want to do any copyright infringement or anything. Showing what's on the TV. It's on right now. I can probably turn it off because I'm not watching it. But yeah, that's something I basically got for Christmas. <laughs> yeah, I got a new TV for Christmas. How about that? But I don't know. I just randomly started showing you that. Not sure why, but I did. Cause I used to have an old TV that couldn't plug anything like HDMI or anything into it. And now I can play the Nintendo Switch on that TV. It's mounted to the wall. Pretty cool, right? Yeah. All right, well, let's start playing this game. Finally, it's about freaking time after me talking for such a long time. Ow, 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 ow. Talk, 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 talk. Okay, here we go. <laughs> let's start. <laughs> see, there it is. You see that? Now we're about to start the stream. Yay. Let's do this.